I'm Mark Bagley, and I'm the founder of MultiRip, the leading hybrid software for the decorated apparel industry. The concept behind MultiRip is to allow a decorator to increase the power of one Epson printer by allowing it to put two different types of ink in it to print dye sublimation transfers, inkjet heat transfers, and screen printing film positives as well as other items like general invoices from one printer. MultiRip is designed to work with several different Epson printers based on whether it be a small format printer which is 13 inches and below like the Epson Stylish Pro 1400 and R1800, a medium format printer which is 17 inches wide like the Epson Stylish Pro 4000, 4800, and 4880, or the large format printers which are more than 24 inches wide like the Epson Stylish Pro 7800, 7880, 9800, and 9880 itself. MultiRip is also specifically designed to work with industry inks like on the sublimation side, the Sublajet IQ, and Artanium inks from Sawgrass Systems. On the heat transfer side, Chromoblast, and multi-ink, and on the film positive side, multi-ink. Multi-RIP is a very simple and easy to use program that allows you to print directly from any graphic software program with some differences and changes for each program that you use. You can print directly from Photoshop, Illustrator, Corel Draw, Corel Paint, and others. All you have to do is go up to the top, click on File, and go down to print. Your printer cues will open up and you'll have the ability to choose either between the MultiRip Stylish Pro or the MultiRip Easy Die Sub and Easy Transfer selections. The Easy Die Sub and the Easy Transfer printers are printers that are already hard coded for you printing onto either polyester fabric with die sublimation ink or on a cotton fabric with heat transfer ink. To get full access to all of MultiRip's profiles, click on the MultiRip Stylish Pro 4800, click on the Properties, go down to Advance, and now you have several drop-down selections which allow you to choose between what paper size you'd like to print, the print quality or resolution depending on what profile you're using and what media type you're printing to. You also have the ability to choose what ink type whether it be dye sublimation or multi-ink. You, you have the choice between choosing any of the media types that we already have specific profiles for. You'll notice the yellow triangles up at the top are all of our profiles for our film positives. The ones in the middle without the yellow triangles are all of our profiles for dye sublimation. And the ones below that are all of our profiles for using either our heat transfer ink or our generic multi-ink. We have specific profiles for whether it is a graphic or clip art. We also have a specific profile for photographs as well, depending on what type of transfer light and dark transfer paper as well. You also have the ability to choose between defining your halftones if you're printing film positives. You can also choose between whether you want to run an RGB or CMYK source profile as well. One thing that's important to know is that there are other printing software programs that allow you to create your printer as a hybrid. But very few of them will actually spend the time and the money to create all of the profiles like MultiRip has. You, you also have the ability to have warning triangles show up when you choose the wrong selections. It will let you know and make it easier and user friendly with that. Once you send your file to MultiRip, if you do not have the correct settings, it'll ask you if you want to change them. If you click yes and change them, you can go back into the program and choose the correct setting. And now when you go to print, it'll now allow you to print. Once you print, the MultiRip interface window will come up. The file will begin to load into the RIP interface and begin to process. You'll have several tabs. The status tab gives you different messages that will come through to help you print. 
You have an incoming jobs tab, which will show the job as it begins the process. You also have a process jobs tab, once the job has been processed, and a pages to printers tab. On the process jobs tab, you can preview your file by double clicking on the file name and then clicking on page one and looking at it. You also can do the same in a different screen from the pages of printer tab by double clicking on the file name and printing it. On the pages of printers tab as well, you can right click over it and choose to create a production run instead of sending 20 copies of the same one file to the RIP, you can send it once and do a production run which will increase your speed when you're printing larger files. You also have a brand new feature in multi-RIP referred to as the imposition feature. The imposition is basically allowing you to create a signature page in multi-RIP where you can send multiple graphics into the RIP, have them stored until your whole signature page has been completely filled out and then it will send them all at once so you can gain different prints up on one page. This is a typically something you would see when you are printing in a large production run or with film positives and you're trying to, re to conserve some of the space of the media itself. Again, Multi-RIP is a very simple and easy to use program. If for more information or for videos or to contact one of the distributors that sells Multi-RIP, please visit www.multirip.com for more information. Thank you.